Hey, a pleasant good day, everyone. This is Sports Night News. I'm Joe Borkin. This is going to be the third edition of the Pond Key Take. This is going to be on Matthias McKelly playing very well for the Tucks and Roadrunners after coming over from Finland, where he played absolutely amazing over in the Liga when he was over there really maturing and nurturing his game in a men's league in Finland. Over there, excuse me, and then really becoming the player that they see in front of their eyes now and developing very quickly at a very quick pace for a fourth rounder and only the 2019 draft. Normally, those guys are the guys that take the more four or five year track sometimes because you pick them in later rounds, you know they have a little bit more thing to fine tune and get going if they're going to make the league and they have a lesser percentage chance, obviously, of them the first two rounders than making the league. As you go by each two rounds, obviously, the percentages get lower. But he's playing great. Uh, show, he showcased his, his scoring and passing talent and prowess with 6 goals and 11 assists in 14 games for 17 points. But in 8 games played, he has all 6 of those goals and 8 assists in the month of November. So Matthias McKelly really started taking off for the Tucks and Roadrunners and for the Arizona Coyotes in the organization that obviously needs to have and continue to create more offense going forward with the likes of if they end up trading Clayton Carroll, they're going to bring in more talent, you would think, via the draft or via people they get from a franchise already that have good value at offense developing in the AHL that are maybe close to coming up to the NHL, you would think, for a value player like Clayton Keller. So this team wants to keep growing. They want to keep rebuilding. They want to obviously keep moving in the right direction with Torney down there as their head coach. And they want to have players like this in the system that really are showing promise that are not only the top-round pick, but their middle-round picks and that is exactly what Matthias McKelly is doing. He's showing his passing. He's showing his um, scoring ability where right now with the Tucks and Roadrunners in his first full season over here, he's above a points per game guy at 17 points in 14 games, 6 goals, 11 assists. This dude can fly out there. He's a guy that was a little bit undervalued because of his size, too. He was listed at 165, 5'11", and so a one or for people that go by the other 75 kilograms, uh, 180 centimeters, so um, he was listed at obviously a smaller size that usually people sometimes overweigh, I think, in my personal opinion, if you got the skill, if you got to build it, you're going to freaking figure it out and find a way to get there, especially if you have that work ethic that it seems like this kid has, as well, already really taking off in his rookie season in only the second month in the league, in the AHL, with all the boys back, all the great AHL veterans are back, because you don't have that taxi squad that you had last year that kept all these guys in a limbo period. It's more regular this year, of course, so all the guys are back. You're playing against those veterans. You're not playing in a league just with all the youngsters, where it's almost like a de facto junior league, more so like it was like last year with veterans mixed in, where you have all the guys back. It's it's the full effect of the AHL this year. Matthias McKelly, after having a great success in Finland and really growing and nurturing in that league, the 21-year-old is developing at a rapid pace for a fourth-round pick and really showing the Coyotes that if he keeps developing at this rate, one, he might get a cup of coffee with the way that roster is, obviously, at the end of this season or at some point this season. But two, definitely at camp next year, looks like a guy that you could see being ready for your third line and and somebody that really is a quick skater, can pass the puck well, and can score the puck a little bit as well, and probably will continue to do that at the next level. I don't know if he'll be much more than like an Ennis-level player, but an Ennis-level player that has a little bit more forechecking chip in his game, I think, than Tyler Ennis has. But that's just my take on Matthias McKelly and him winning the Rookie of the Month. And great success story he is as a fourth-round pick, really developing nicely 2019 fourth-rounder. For the Coyotes, a nice success story for an organization that obviously has not had the most keen success of late. So peace out, everybody. Have a great day and pleasant day. Special thanks to the 170 that have already subbed. If you enjoy the content, please continue to subscribe to keep the channel going and growing. This has been the, uh, the third edition of the Ponky Take as we go over Matthias McKelly being the Rookie of the Month in the AHL. Peace out, everybody.